The Take Along Thomas and Friends Show. Subscribe and thumbs up for even more episodes. Ed Edward is a very wise engine on the island of Sodor. He is also a very useful engine on the island of Sodor. Even though he might be old, an old engine, he's still proud of to be working on Sir Topham Hat Hatch Railway. And Sir Tom Matt is also proud of him. When one day, Edward was just puffing along. Toot toot, said Edward. And then he, went, then he had to stop at a signal. Uh, when he looked to his left, he saw Gordon puffing down the hill. And he also saw s Diesel's talking in a sighting. Steamies are so outdated. Steamies are so outdated. Steamies, when will they ever go away? They're so outdated that Sir Tom Mad just needs to open his eyes and see that Diesels will one day rule the world. And then one of the Diesels had, had looked up and saw Gordon coming coming down. Well, 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 look, look at what we have, these fellow Diesels. Look behind you, Diesel. Huh? Well, 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 isn't it a s well, 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 it's a steamy. <laughs> you're, you're going to, you're just future scrap. I'll have you know, shut the heck up. You're just future scrap like we said. <laughs> Thomas was right there in their sighting watching them. Gordon is laughing about us with the diesels. I must tell everyone I know at once, said Thomas, and Thomas puffed away. Before Edward could try and tell Thomas all the way to the, to the siding, Edward's signal opened, and Edward just puffed away. <laughs> First engine Thomas came to was Percy. Thomas got him closer, closer. Hello, Thomas, said Percy. Oh, hi, Percy. I got some news for you right now. What could it be? Said, asked Percy. I saw Gordon laughing with the diesels and talking about us steamies. He might be deciding to dump us steamies and go as a diesel member. What? I can't believe this. But Gordon is our friend. I saw him fair and square. So, I think, tell every engine you you come across okay just pass on the word right away Thomas and with that Percy puffed away to find another engine <laughs> the first engine Percy was chuffing to was James Percy had gotten closer to James uh, Percy what do you want I got some news for you James uh, earlier, Thomas had told me that he had saw Gordon laughing with the Diesels and telling bad stories about us. What? I knew one day that Big Blue Tender Engine would screw something up about us. <sighs> well, tell every engine you come across. Got that? Got that. And with that, James puffed backwards to find another engine. The, f the fur... The engine that James came across was Henry, and he told Henry, who told Duck after James had told him, and then Duck finally told Oliver, and soon word got around the island that James was laughing with the Diesels and telling vicious stories about them. Later that day, Thomas was Thomas was just sick sitting on the line and he he was just sitting at the station and then Gordon came up with the express hello little Thomas said Gordon I'm not talking to you said Thomas I saw you earlier talk talking to the diesels and laughing at us and telling vicious stories about us to them who told you that lie said Gordon no one. It wasn't a lie. I saw you fair and square. But, but, no buts. G 
Gordon, Gordon decided, Gordon d decided not to argue. He just got uncoupled from the express and puffed away sadly. Ooh, ooh, as he let out a sad, sad whistle. And soon, Edward came down the same line with, as Gordon did. Did you get the Did you get the story yet, Edward? Said Thomas. Yes. And what you And what you heard wasn't the whole story. What do you mean? Asked Thomas. The whole story is: I got there before you, and I saw that the the Diesels were talking. We're talking bad about the steamies, and you you didn't get there on time, and Gordon was just going down the line. He saw they they saw him, and they started talking bad about him. And then they started laughing at him. You were only there to think that Gordon was laughing with them. <gasps> I didn't get the whole story. Gordon wasn't la Gordon wasn't laughing at us. He was being laughed at. With that news, Thomas felt horrible, and he and he left to find Gordon as soon as possible. Pee pee, and Thomas puffed away as soon as he could. Good thing I found out; otherwise, Gordon's reputation with this island would have been ruined. Thomas was still on the way to looking for Gordon, and then he found Gordon in the quarry, all alone. Sad and alone. Gordon! Gordon! What do you want? No engine likes me on this island anymore. I might as well just move to, oh, I don't know, America. No, you can't do that. Because the thing is, the, me and all the other engines didn't get the whole story. Oh, oh yeah, that's right. The thing is, Edward told me the whole thing. And so... I was wrong, and so were the other engines, too. So, if you forgive me, Gordon, thank you very much. But if you don't, I understand. And I'll, next time when I think I should start jumping to conclusions and doing things that I have no idea what I'm doing sometimes, I should just get the whole story first. Thank you, Thomas. Will you tell the other engines the whole story soon? Yes, I'll tell them as soon as possible after, after this. Thank you, Thomas. Thomas had very had learned a very l valuable lesson today, and that you shouldn't start jumping to conclusions about situations that you didn't get the whole story for. Gordon was happy too, and he was happy that he could trust Thomas, and that he was and that Thomas was his best friend. Gord Thomas thought the same thing of Gordon being his best friend. It was a very happy and very sad, but. But then it went straight to happy day on the island of Sodor.